few words about the uh, profile of the uh, American College of Greece. Uh, it's a fairly old institution founded in 1875 in Asia Minor. Provides uh, an integrated array of uh, educational services today, starting with um, the division of the um, uh, gymnasium and high school, the uh, well-known uh, Pierce College, um, with about 900 students. Moving into uh, Erie, which is the um, undergraduate and graduate branch of the uh, academic institution with about uh, 2,500 students. And uh, the recent acquisition of the uh, Alba Business School, one of the premier business schools in uh, Europe with about 500 students. The undergraduate uh, branch, the uh, re-offers um, through uh, three faculties, uh, uh, schools, uh, 21 majors and um, 31 minors uh, in uh, business areas, uh, liberal arts and sciences, and the uh, fine and performing arts. And at the graduate level, DRI um, focuses on um, liberal arts programs in communication, psychology, uh, modern technologies such as uh, digital media <coughs> communications. And through the uh, Alba Business Schools, primarily, um, for uh, MBAs uh, and Masters in Finance, Risk Management, Shipping, uh, Tourism, uh, Business for Lawyers. Um, for different array of uh, uh, graduate students uh, coming either directly from uh, the undergraduate programs or uh, later on at the level of senior management. The uh, American College of Greece uh, has world-class facilities. Um, it's located in the outskirts of Mount Mythos, 64 acres. Uh, modern classrooms, uh, US kind or North American kind of campus with um, uh, one of the largest libraries in Europe. Excellent athletic facilities has been the uh, training center for the US Olympic team in 2004. Students that uh, would be interested to uh, spend one semester or a longer period of time, especially coming from North America, will feel like home. Uh, it's going to be um, a wide selection of um, uh, academic courses, over a thousand in different disciplines, um, fully accredited uh, by IGNIAS, the New England Accreditation Body for uh, Schools and Colleges, and at the same time also validated by the Open University, the UK. Open University, and uh, they will also be uh, encouraged to participate in uh, an array of uh, student life activities, uh, including participation in a variety of clubs and societies, cultural and academic events that happen constantly on campus, and uh, enriching opportunities uh, primarily because the campus is becoming a very internationalized area for uh, our students. <coughs> this is part of our strategy. There are also significant career opportunities from day one. Students are nurtured to develop their uh, CVs, as we say, um, offered opportunities to work on campus, participate in international internships programs or local internship programs, um, and also uh, prepare themselves for um, uh, graduate studies um, outside Greece uh, in uh, Various countries, including Canada. I'll show you some examples of Canadian universities that are typically accepting our students. In terms of international internships, uh, we are uh, developing uh, collaborations with international groups such as the Libra Group, Coca Cola, SB, um, and together with our uh, work study programs and other uh, work facilities, we offer over. Uh, 150 to 200 uh, placements a year for our students. And typically the results of um, our students finding jobs after they graduate are uh, rather impressive, especially in today's working environment. Um, this is a survey uh, of our graduates after eight months, within eight months from their graduation, 61% of them with a bachelor's degree are able to find a job. An area that we have uh, been very much interested in, it's very um, uh, in line with today's event, is the study abroad programs that we have. Uh, we believe in these programs, both for um, 
the opportunities that we give to our students to study abroad, but also the opportunities for uh, international students to um, come to Greece and uh, experience the uh, uh, cultural and learning opportunities that we offer. Here you can see a list of institutions um, that we collaborate with, including um, 13 of the top 50 US institutions. Uh, we definitely like to add some Canadian institutions here. Um, and these are institutions with which we have partnerships. So students can pay um, their home institution. So these are exchange agreements. Uh, we also have faculty-led programs, specialized programs, such as, for example, the Heritage Greece program, where um, second or third generation Greeks have never visited Greece, have the opportunity to spend a semester here. The um, uh, academic schedule is um, basically aligned with uh, Northern European institutions, so we offer a uh, fall semester, uh, spring, and two summer sessions. So typically students uh, can um, uh, study without um, having to disturb their studies uh, if they uh, come from uh, a foreign institution. These are uh, some institutions that have accepted our students for graduate studies, and on the right hand side we've added some of the Canadian institutions that you can see that are typically accepting our students. And uh, one of the board approved uh, strategies or initiatives for the American College of Greece is to uh, continue this internationalization, as you can see from some of the numbers. The first one, the top 50 university agreements has now uh, reached 10. Uh, currently, we're in discussions with um, three of the top 50 institutions in uh, North America that are interested to establish other um, European operations and uh, broader Mediterranean operations on our campus. Um, inbound study abroad, students now uh, count to about 140 to 180, expected for 2013-14. The outbound study abroad, slightly smaller, 30 to 40. International internships now are uh, counting to 35, and um, residential students now uh, 280 to 340 expected for uh, this academic year. We do have uh, residences available, about five minutes located from our campus that can accommodate a significant number of students. Thank you.